God works through generations. He calls us to impact them in intentional ways. Deuteronomy 6 provides a, a really great roadmap. Um, it talks about being intentional, teaching your kids to love God with all your heart, your soul, and, and your strength. But it goes on and talks about when you're walking in the way with your kids, you're to impress the things of God upon their heart. You're to be living authentically uh, and reflecting the life of Christ through the way we live as leaders, uh, as parents. And it, it's to have an impact upon our kids to equip them to be the next generation uh, of godly leaders. As the baby boomers are about to move out and the next generation coming in and other subsequent generations being in building years, you begin to look at the moral climate and the spiritual climate of the generations moving into now positions of influence. And that's concerning. There's a, a waning Christian worldview taking place with this shift. We have some very big challenges, I think, from the spiritual climate as we see this shift beginning to take place. The second dynamic of this shift is really taking place uh, from what I would call emerging markets, uh, both from a social economic point of view and from a shift in, in thought leadership. Eleven new emerging countries are now part of uh, the governing body that will determine financial and, and the economic climate of the world. Many of them are, are very much not from a world Christian uh, view, and uh, our children will be faced as being leaders within a new dynamic uh, place. Our kids, numerically, will really be a minority. It begs the question, what role do we play here? What have we done as influencers in preparing the generations that are coming up and uh, impacting us, and what do we need to be doing? Christian parents, educators, Christian leaders, play a very significant role in that, in influencing these generations. As parents and as teachers, we have to become much more missional in the way that we think about, about school and impacting generations. I think as parents, you know, I would really love to challenge uh, parents, as I'm challenging myself, is to engage with the school beyond just being uh, an institution, to being a missional place, which is very much part of God's strategic plan in preparing a generation.